Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So first I want to apologize for not posting any videos. Like the worst thing happened to me and if you follow me on Instagram you already know. But uh, basically my hard drive failed from my laptop so I wasn't able to record any videos uh, for you guys. And I was really bummed out about it because it was when I decided to make my schedule which was every Tuesday and Thursdays and then like I think I did like I was able to do like the first week and then nothing anymore but I'm back now and I even bought an external hard drive so that's not gonna happen anytime soon and um, yeah so today's video I was actually I haven't been inspired to do any makeup looks or wear any lashes uh, my eyes have been feeling really itchy um, but I wanted to share with you guys um, some lipstick colors um, and basically I did post a picture recently and a lot of people kept asking me what was I wearing on my lips. My lips looked um, bigger, you know, and it, it was more of like a sultry lip. So I wanted to just make a video for you guys um, to show you like how I achieved that look for my lips. And um, yeah, so what I'm wearing on my lips right now is just um, this nourishing lip balm from Sweet Face by Rocio. And it smells amazing but it's not like too heavy it's like just enough to just create a, like a, a base for what I'm about to do first I just want to go over like lipstick colors and options but basically in that look I chose crap it flew off um, a color like this so it's a little brown it, lo it looks a little brown that's how I would describe it it's called mauve here you can see it better and that's it swatched and that's basically w a base color that I start with so other options that I have for that are this lipstick by Bilani it's naturally chic number 25 and it's basically not too rosy, not too brown, not too anything, you know, just like a mauve color. And this is a probably a color that not that many people go for when you want to, when you think of like nude colors, do you want to go for more like really really nude, which I don't think looks good on everyone. And then this is just a sample of a tart one. This is I don't know what color this is. Oh, this is Inspired. Basically, those they're all the same type of color. And then on top of it, I would put this color, which is more of like an actual nude color. This is a Maybelline Truffle Tease. So that's what I did. Another one is Milani Nude Cream. And then this is what you would add for the center of the lip which would give like a full effect because it would make your lip look like it's naturally just that plump Cause it, and it's also like a natural color the other thing is another option is this Urban Decay um, Native this is one of their revolution lipsticks mm, you can know I have a bunch of options but um, my camera is about to die so if it's not one thing it's the other um, I don't have that much time but yeah this NARS Orgasm Mm, lip gloss this is like if you really want to go for that sultry look which I think for nudes I, um, it does look better when it's glossy um, but yeah and then I have like wet and wild uh, options so um, I'm just gonna go ahead and show it to you guys and then like list um, the options that I have down below um, so I'm gonna do the NYX lip pencil. See? It's just like my lip color, but like prettier. And then make sure you get like even like all the way up to here. Which I don't know what that's called, but like get in there. Like,
but you want to be able to do anything talk and whatever I forgot the cat fell and not see a difference in the color you know um, so yeah so then I'm gonna that's like my base my second base and I'm gonna use um, Mary Kay shell And then, just for the middle, this is actually my favorite one. Um, this is like from their new collection, I think. New or nude? Because I'm not sure if it's that new. <laughs> but yeah, it's the, the Maybelline Truffle Tees. And we're just going to use that in the middle. And now my lips, you know, they look fuller. And it comes off really great on camera. It, do you know how like sometimes like when you wear lipsticks, um, it can sometimes, depending on like the undertone of the color, make your lip, your teeth look yellow? Um, I feel like when you start with like a, a very, very light nude color, that could tend to happen a lot, like your teeth start looking yellow. But when you go for like a mauve undertone first, um, I feel like it, that doesn't really happen. I've noticed a lot and it just shows off a lot better. So that's what it looks like like that. Let's with the full. And then to, to have like more fullness, I would say, wait, I forgot. Well, this one I didn't show. But this is a Laura Mercier um, color in Bare Naked. So I'm going to use this one because it's a little lighter than the other one I had started you from NARS. Just in the middle. And it smells so good. <laughs> so there you have it. And this... Was a, oh my god, I, I love to do like these natural lips. Obviously, I'm talking about full lips way too much right now. But I just wanted to share that with you guys because I'm, I was getting a lot of questions about like that lip color. And I have like in the pictures, it's always like slightly different. Like I always use different um, brands to achieve that um, this look. Uh, so that's why like I want to like still list it down below at the end uh, like the high-end versions and like the low end because I even have like wet and wild options you know what I mean so I mean I don't really have any Chanel but any nude anyways I'm rambling too much now so that's the video <laughs> I have another one up for you guys um, pretty soon and I hope you guys enjoyed it and I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye guys.